Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. If you guys are new, I'm Kelsey. And I'm Keaton. And this is KLCXKLG. And in today's video, we want to do a mukbang. But in and out. Yeah, up in and out. <laughs> We're really excited to do this. We wanted to have a video where we just like sat down and talked to you guys. We feel like it's been like so long since we've like even talked to the camera or like really been in the camera. Yeah. Um, because we've been doing a lot of TikTok. Um, Wait, so I need to catch up first, actually. Yeah, it's just been so long that we've even like tried to talk to you guys. We miss like vlogging, we miss like actually being on YouTube. Oh, so I like YouTube the most for sure. Like, yeah, yeah. I think we're saying when we got done, like, we've been doing a lot of TikTok. I feel like we basically have to if you want to grow. Like, it doesn't seem like yeah. a lot of people on YouTube are like, you can't really grow organically on YouTube these days. It's really yeah, hard. Yeah, exactly. Even though I, I like YouTube way more than TikTok. Yeah, it's, very, it's way more personal, obviously. Um, and it just like gives us a chance to like connect with you guys. But um, And it's just more fun. Like, I don't know, I edit all the videos and like I have way more fun editing YouTube videos than I do like TikTok videos. Like TikTok is much more just like throwaway content. Whereas I feel like a lot of our vlogs and stuff are like, I don't know, we took a lot of time and like we're very thoughtful about them. Whereas our TikTok videos, like, I'm proud of our YouTube videos. I'm not like proud of our TikToks. It's just like, okay. Yeah. yeah. That makes sense. Sorry, I just did right in because I'm really hungry. But I got the um, animal style cheeseburger with chopped chili, fries, and Dr. Pepper. What'd you get? Um, I got a double double with no lettuce or tomatoes, with pickles and onions, yeah. and a chocolate shake. And yeah, we, fries. We really like it. And now, um, I would say we go like when it's convenient to go. I still think it's overrated, but it is good. I will say it's, it's, it's not good. bad. Because it's so cheap, mm -hmm. like all this together is like $20. And in LA, that's like nothing. <laughs> it's really not. Yeah. It's literally $6 for a gallon of gas. So mm -hmm. three gallons basically for this. Yeah. So sad. Um. Yeah, we wanted to like sit down and kind of talk like what we've been up to, like why we haven't been as consistent on YouTube. I mean, we kind of mentioned we really wanted to get into TikTok, um, but there's just been like other things we've been trying to like venture out to that like we wanted to like update you guys on. Um, yeah, kind of just like talk about what our life's been like recently because it's been like kind of. It seems like it's not crazy, but it, I feel like it is. Yeah. Maybe more so for Keaton rather than me. So I feel like you should kind of talk about like mainly what you've been like focusing on right now. I mean, a lot of it has been TikTok to be honest. Like, yeah. we post twice a day. If you haven't followed us, check us out. KLCXKLG. But other than that, I do like, I don't know, I've like really enjoyed editing YouTube videos like I mentioned. So I'm trying to like transition to start doing it, like creating videos and content for companies. And so like, I don't know if you've seen me on Instagram before, you know, that I like really like film photography and I've incorporated it in our videos a lot too. Yeah. Um, and so like I just started taking that more seriously and like I'm starting to try to book like people for portraits and like try to start working with corporate clients and stuff like that. So I'm really excited about that. And if you guys didn't um, know too, Keaton like did photography mm -hmm. in high school, like in college. Yeah, he's he's always like done it. Like sometimes people are like how did he learn how to do that? Or like, when did he start this hobby? And I'm like, well, he's honestly been doing it. Like, mm -hmm. like photography, not really film, but like. You got a book in that one? Yeah, my, my book. Oh, it was like literally book. drooling. Yeah. I got a book with someone, you should both. Sorry. Yeah, he's been he's been into that forever. He's like a very artistic person at heart, which a lot of people mm -hmm. might honestly find surprising if you were to meet Keaton. Well, I sometimes guess. I work in finance, so it's like yeah. really interesting dynamic. Yeah, he's a very artistic person, which like I've always loved. Um, so yeah, like he's been spending a lot of time doing that. I've like been going with him to some shoots. Obviously, like you guys, if you see him on Instagram, like there's even in our YouTube videos, I've been like a lot of the pictures. Like I, mm -hmm. I mean, just naturally I'm always with Keaton. Um, and I do like taking pictures, and honestly, like it's made me consider wanting to model even possibly. Um, but yeah, so like that's kind of like what we've been doing a lot over the weekend and stuff. And then we just like came to the, um, oh god, this is fucking soggy. So good. Mm. 
No Culver's though. It's no Culver's. I'm not gonna lie. Every day in LA, I miss Culver's. <laughs> Every day. When we see people like who still live in Minnesota, or like even the Midwest, go there, like, I always get so salty. But that's also like why we came to like the agreement and why we wanted to like start posting every two weeks. It's because we really just wanted to focus like all of our energy into TikTok. Just because like sadly like YouTube I think is like slowly dying. Like let us know in the comments if you guys agree. But I just like, we've noticed like such a shift. I feel like, um, like people know this. TikTok's just like where you go for everything now. Mm -hmm. um, so that's kind of where we like just venture out to naturally. Um, but I actually really like TikTok. I think it's a lot of fun. I think it's fun. I just think it's much less creative mm -hmm. than YouTube. Like YouTube, you can really do whatever you want. And on TikTok, like it's also just like random. I don't know. Like we've had videos that I got a few videos that they have like a couple thousand views, but it's like random ass videos. Um, what else we going on in our life? Mm -hmm. Birthdays coming up, both of us. Yeah. Yeah, we both have April birthdays. Sorry, we live here super hungry, so honestly. Should we even say what time it is? It's 10 o'clock. <laughs> 10? It's way than that. Let's see, let's do the reveal. Oh, I think this might be backwards, but... 10 oh my god, it's 10.40. 10 <laughs> yeah, it's sad. Uh... We had a phone. To talks and then Keaton was helping me with something like else and then yeah. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite thing about LA so far? Do you have one? Probably mainly the weather, honestly. Yeah. Okay. Um, I mean, I really love going on like hikes and going to the beach. I feel like that's just like something that. We've never had it everywhere we've lived before. Mm -hmm. So I think it's just like really cool that we're able to even do that. Yeah, you? definitely that's unique. Um, hmm. I think my favorite thing honestly so far is just been like meeting people. Mm -hmm. Like I've met a lot of pretty really, really cool people since I've been here. Not like that. Mm -hmm. But I'm still trying to move to New York though. New York is lit. We had so much fun on a trip in New York. You guys, we asked him that literally like every night. I asked him to go to bed and be like, I still want to move to New York. I'm just like, oh my god. The thing that I don't like about LA is that it's so spread out and it's so like quiet and like slow. Mm -hmm. Like I love being able to like in New York just like walk outside and like catch vibe. Like you can do that everywhere in New York. Whereas here, like walk outside right now, <clears throat> you might see like three people walking around. Yeah, like naturally we're city people, I would say. I think that mainly came from living in Chicago. Um, and we just like fell in love with the fact of being in the city, so. Mm -hmm. And I I honestly always miss Chicago. But I always tell Keaton too, it's like, I feel like when you get like when you leave the spot you were living in, that's when you realize like, oh my god, like I miss it, I want to go back, like all this stuff. So like I know if we were to leave LA, we'd be like, oh I miss it. Like mm -hmm. I, and that's what's so like so hard is like sometimes in the moment you don't always realize like how cool something is or like how much you actually enjoy it until it's gone. Mm -hmm. So even when we were in New York for like a month, I like we had honestly that was like so chaotic because we did so much in just a span of a month that we like didn't even really have time to be like this is crazy like what we're doing mm -hmm. but now when you look back on it it's like oh my god like we just like always want to go back there but yeah so it's hard like i think it's also like for me personally we're not getting any younger i mean obviously we're still really young but like trying to figure out like how we're gonna get a home one day and like stuff like that and like Tolkien I don't really know if I want to continue to keep moving around places but I also come down to live in other places so it's just like I don't know it's confusing and a hard decision. I like it here it's just like also so expensive to buy a house yeah like every time we go around and look in our neighborhood like random houses not even nice ones a million 
But that's yeah. literally everywhere we want to live. Like, that's the thing about us. Like, we, so far though. Yeah. I mean, I also maybe live in Miami. Mm -hmm. But there's really not a lot of places that I like actually want to move to. Yeah, it's definitely hard. So, I don't know. Yeah, if you like where you live, let us know. Why we should move there. Mm -hmm. We need options that aren't expensive. We're not moving anytime soon here, though. Just a heads up. Even my name is probably expensive. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but just so you guys know, this is not meaning we're like leaving LA right now. We're planning on here for like at least a couple more years, so. Mm -hmm. And we might not even end up leaving. I mean, who knows? We're honestly open to whatever. I feel like we always have been that way. I just like traveling and like having <clears throat> new experiences. Like anytime you move somewhere, obviously you just naturally have that. Mm -hmm. What else um, is new? Not really new, but I think we maybe mentioned this. But we want to take a big trip with just us to go out of the country and we're thinking of going to Italy. Mm -hmm. Maybe in September. So like that's on the calendar. But still have to plan that. Like, I've wanted to go to Italy since I was, like, 12. That's, like, the number one place I've always wanted to go to. I've talked about it forever. And I will just be, like, the happiest person in the world there. Like, I just, I already know that. I already I'll know. love you there, yeah. And we're planning on, I think, going to, this is, like, not set in stone, but we're thinking Rome, Tuscany. Um, I forgot one. I know I'm off the coast. Maybe it's just those three. It depends, like, because it just takes so long to get there on a plane. So we're thinking maybe a week and a half and, like, going over our holidays. We don't have to, like, take a ton of time off work. We would be, like, there for, like, two weeks? Yeah. Maybe not two weeks. I think a week and a half would be fine because you have to, like, counter, like, maybe a day and a half of travel. Yeah. Well, actually, that's a full day. So a day. So then, yeah. I'd want at least, like, seven days, maybe more, like, you know, during the whole trip, but. Yeah, I'm pumped. Yeah, we have a lot of places, like, we want to go, so. Mm -hmm. Just kind of start doing it. But yeah, I mean, that's really, like, the update, honestly. Yeah. I'm trying to, like, think, but yeah. I, I feel like we just haven't talked to you guys in so long, and, like, what's even been going on? Yeah, I appreciate everyone who like still tunes in. I mean, we still love YouTube, like we said. Like, I prefer YouTube over TikTok. Like, we still definitely want to have YouTube as a focus on our channel. I mean, like, yeah, we still want to focus on YouTube for sure. We're just posting like less often. So yeah. like once every two weeks, first once every week. But definitely, are still like, yeah, like planning on uploading like consistently, just every two weeks versus every week. Mm -hmm. So we should, yeah, we should have some cool like vlogs coming up soon. Mm -hmm. If we vlog for like our birthdays, like we're going to Disney for mine. Like also, there's so many places we want to go in California, like Yosemite or San Diego or. I'm literally. What's that like? Palm Springs. Yeah, Good there's really places. Yeah, um, mountain, literally. Big Bear. Like what's mm -hmm. the other like um super, like Lake Tahoe? Like there's a ton of places. So that'll be a lot of really cool vlogs too. So. Yeah, definitely, like, yeah, we don't like think that. we're not, like, yeah, going to continue to upload, because we definitely are, and still have, like, a lot of really cool content coming up, so be sure to keep up and look out for that, but yeah, anything else? No. Hope you guys enjoyed watching us stuff our face with food. If you've never had it now, and you come to LA or anywhere on the West Coast, definitely You have to get the burger I got. The chop shit, the animal style, cheeseburger chop chili is so good. I think everyone should get that one. Yeah, pretty good. But anyways, thanks so much for tuning in. We'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Peace.